I, I love Stars on Ice and being able to be a part of it. Um, performing is what I got into skating for, so being here and being able to be a part of it amongst so many great skaters is really helping me. What keeps me on the ice is, is literally the performing. Um, while, when I was off and not being able to skate and then when I was even back and just doing a bit of practicing, I really miss being in front of a crowd and being able to perform and just skate my heart out and see everyone enjoy it and um, so that's exactly what drove me to come back is to perform again. I got into skating because of my older sister. Um, Natasha was a, is three years older than me and I was often at the rink to watch her skate and then my parents wanted me to ho be a hockey player so they put me into can skate to learn how to skate so it was a picture of my sister and my parents and it just, I love skating. I don't have too many hobbies outside of skating. Um, it's what I've always done is skate. Um, but last year being injured, I've had to come up with a couple of different things to do when I wasn't on the ice. Um, so I took up a bit of golf, even though I can't say I'm amazing at it. <laughs> um, and I finally started uh, some university classes, which I'm excited for. I'm in for communications and then furthering into like journalism and broadcasting. So I'm really excited for that. Um, but all in all, I just love to read and watch TV and just enjoy being with friends. There's a lot of Netflix shows that I watch and a lot of movies, um, but I guess the one that I'm watching right now is The 100. To any six-year-old, I suggest that you just have fun with whatever you're doing, whether it's on the ice or on a soccer field or a volleyball court, anything. Um, if you enjoy what you're doing, then you're just you'll get further in it if you're not dreading to go practice every day. Um, this is still really weird looking over there. Um, oh, sorry. <laughs>